Hello? <laughs> Hello? Is anyone there? Probably not. Not yet. Let me get on the right tab here. There we go. <sighs> Will, let's play the notification game. Will it send out notifications? Yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. <laughs> There's everyone. Hey, guys. What is up? The Neocubist here. Welcome to a little stream. We're going to be doing Fork Survival today. Um, an absolute dream of a map. It is literally... I'm sorry for doing that so many times. It is literally a giant, and I mean giant, fork. Now, you're thinking to yourself, dude, how can it be a giant fork? And... uh I'm so sorry about minimizing it so many times. Why are we playing on a giant fork? And, you know, that's that's a very good question. And, uh, you know, normally I would have the answer for you. And I'm sorry, I'm pretty sure my microphone is not... Give me one second. It needs to be at 79. There we go. Okay. Sorry. For some reason... Yeah, for some reason Windows thinks it knows better and always changes it. Welcome to Galaxy One. Thank you so much for the super chat. I'm not going to be giving signs on this world, unfortunately. So if you guys to choose to donate via super chat, first of all, thank you. But second of all, uh, there, well, I just want to focus on the actual gameplay this time. Um, but yes, we're playing on a giant fork. But welcome to Galaxy One. Thank you so much for your super chat. You said hi, Neo. How's your day going? It's going pretty good. And I hope yours is going good too. Sean Williams, thank you so much for your super chat. You said, what up, my dude? Not much. Just playing on a giant fork. But thank you guys both for your super chat, Sean Williams and the Galaxy O1. I do appreciate it. Okay, so we started off in a plane crash right here. I know I kind of just jumped out without saying any anything at all. Um, so there's three books in here. They were in this chest. By the way, this map is made by, uh, I think it's Sy Scythebrine. I don't know. Or sandbox guy. So go check them out on YouTube and let them know I'm streaming and let them know. I mean, this is this will be uploaded after the fact too. But I really want to show them some love. They made quite a few really good maps and they don't have any recognition. So shout out to sandbox guy or site the brain. Thank you guys uh, or thank you so much for the amazing map. But yeah, go check out their YouTube channel. Uh, link is in the description. You can click on it and go download the map for yourself. Um, but yes. So the rules of this map: mobs do spawn. Be careful at night. Mobs don't affect terrain. For example, creepers explode, but don't blow up your house. That's awesome. Rain transfers into snow above Y95. Cool. You do drop your items when you die. And uh, you can change the game rules and other options in order to enjoy it more. But we're not going to change anything. We're going to do it just how the creator intended. Optional tasks. Um, adventure time. Explore the map. I believe I can fly. Use elytra and fireworks to fly. Hello, which is explore the mysterious nether castle. Can it? Can I get it any cheaper? <laughs> Trade with the villager. Treasure hunter, find the note which leads you to the hidden treasure. The end, kill the inner dragon. Um, so there's a ton of really cool tasks, and I'm excited to do them. Uh, but the story of this map is, am I still alive? What just happened? I think we crashed. But where am I? Where is everyone? The only thing I remember... The only thing I remember from falling is a giant fork. Is this a dream? <laughs> well, I better move on. I don't want to waste time. I guess I need to survive. So we're going to survive on a giant fork. Thank you, Not Boomer, for the super chat. I really do appreciate all the support, guys. You guys are honestly a little bit too kind to me. I don't, I, I, I don't deserve it all, but you guys, you guys really are too sweet. Okay, so, I'm sorry, I keep adjusting my mic. I know we've, we've been here for a little bit. I'm sure I was trying to wait for some more people to get on, but it's kind of a weird time to stream, so I don't really think that many people are going to be watching. But, um, either way, it's going to be pretty exciting. So let's do a little bit of exploration before we start here. Um, essentially, this map is a giant fork, which I know you saw in the thumbnail. So, it's just a weird map. <laughs> uh, there's a village over there, it looks like. I don't know what that is. It looks like a nether portal or something almost. A giant bee, which is actually very well done. And thank you, Sir Stone, for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. You guys are too kind. It's not Boomer, Sir Stone, the Galaxy, Sean Williams. Thank you guys all so much. I really do appreciate you guys. And then we have a giant... I don't know what you'd call that. A boat? It's like a boat with a laser at the top. I really don't know, but it looks really cool. And then this is the flat moon. So there's a moon up there that we can go explore. 
And I hear some things. We're not gonna, okay. No, we're not gonna go in there just yet because I don't want to die. I don't have anything. One thing I did want to do is collect these berries and start getting some early game food started because well, we don't have any food sources. And I would really prefer you know not to die. That would be great. I, it really would. But yeah, we're just going to get some berries very early on. I think that's going to be the honest... I think, honestly, that's going to be the best choice. Just a little bit of berries going. I want to figure out where I want to live, though. I don't want to live inside the shipwreck. There's no... Or a plane wreck, sorry. We don't want to live there, but I'm going to go up on this mountain and see if we can't see a little bit of the fork shape of this world. And we're going to see what's at the top of this, because hopefully it's something pretty cool. Is this going to affect the other survival world? No. No, of course not. This is just a this is a completely separate map. This is just a custom map that you can download. Link in the description. Shout out to Sandbox Guy. So there appears There appears to be the head of the fork. If that's what it's called, the the main part of the fork, the spokes of the fork, if you will. And then we go down here to the handle. <laughs> it really is kind of cool. Um it's a neat concept, that's that's for sure. Okay, so we're going to go... What is this? Let's see. I found a bell. What is in here? Oh. Ooh, Depth Strider 1. Okay. I'll take that. I'll take all these goodies. Okay, we can make a little potato farm. Nice. And, ooh, a cooked salmon. I'm going to start calling it salmon just to mess with you guys. But, yeah, cooked salmon. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. What's in this barrel? Mmm, pumpkin pie. Two raw cod. We don't need that. Water bottle. String, the clown, tropical fish. Cool, let's ring the bell. Just like you guys should, you guys should. <laughs> That's what I should start doing. Oh, gosh. Cecilia, thank you so much for your super chat. You you did a, a big, a big-eyed face thing. I'm not exactly sure what that is, but it's, it's kind of cool. So thank you, Cecilia, for the super chat. Michelle Knowles, thank you for joining in on another stream. You said, how are you guys? I'm very intrigued by this map. Me too, Michelle, me too. Uh, I think we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. I just woke up, and uh, yeah, we're just going to have some fun on this map. So thank you, Michelle. Thank you, Cecilia. And thank you, Mom, for your super chat. She says, hi, Neo and Lauren. Love you, Mom, and thank you for the support. Uh, hello to you, too. But yes, thank you. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you, Cecilia. You guys are all very, very appreciated. Okay, so like this bell is hanging here. If you guys are subscribed to my channel and you don't have the bell on, click it. But you don't have to, though, if you don't want to. We're just going to move on from this. Uh, is that a sunken little baby ship? That is honestly the cutest little ship I've ever seen. And it's conveyed so well. It has coral on it. Ooh, ooh efficiency one. It's oh, an ore. Ooh, that's smart. See, I'm telling you, this map designer is very, very good. I I've played a lot of custom maps over the years. And this is by far one of the best. So seriously, if you guys if you guys want to show this person some love, their video has like 1.1 thousand views. It deserves so... <gasps> oh, I just lost everything, dude. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. No, <laughs> are you serious? Are you serious? I just started the map. I'm an idiot. I don't know why I just walked straight off the map. <gasps> I just got all that stuff, literally everything, and I just straight fell off. The, are you serious, dude? Okay. Okay, well, thankfully we didn't really have a lot, I guess. We had a, a wooden shovel, and, well, we didn't really have a whole lot. So, you know what? I'm okay with dying. At least we didn't get a lot of stuff and then die. <laughs> Whoops. And I'm sorry, chat, that I'm not, you know, replying to everyone. It's just, it's hard to see. There's so many people talking that, you know, I, and I try my absolute best, but there's just a lot of people here. And I feel like I go crazy if I look at the chat and read everything because I see too many things. And, like, I want to talk to you all. I genuinely do, but I can't. And if I, if I start to, then the stream just gets all wonky. Um, but, yes, hopefully this video, if you guys are watching, watching it after it's not live, thank you for choosing to click on this video. So many videos out there on the internet now, it's a wonder that I even get any views at all. But thank you so much for choosing to watch me. I appreciate it. Okay. So we got some wooden starter tools. I'm trying to just get my bearings here. And remember, we're on a giant fork. You know? Because it's not, it's not every day, you know, you're on a giant fork. Hey, hello, Mr. Sheep. How am I? I'm doing pretty good. Thank you for asking. 
I hope you're doing good too. Hello guys, welcome to the stream. But seriously, I, I, I don't I don't quite understand what this is what what this is supposed to be, but I'm excited for it. Like I've said, I, I I'm trying to, ooh, okay, we need the coal. Stu eight nine nine, thank you so much for your super chat. You said, hey, Neo, never caught a live stream before, but love your videos and want to say thank you as I've been going through a rough time and your vids help. Well, hey, uh, I'm glad to hear that my videos help. Uh, nothing makes me happier than to hear that I've helped someone through anything. And uh, I'm very glad to help you. And thank you so much for your support. I really do appreciate it. I hope every good you're going through, it'll probably pass. But if not, you can, just, you can watch my, my channel forever. Maybe it'll help. I don't know. But either way, thank you for your super chat. I appreciate it. Okay, so there is... Okay, I guess... I mean, this is a man-made coal, coal vein, so I'm glad it's not too big. Because sometimes you know how coal goes. You just get a giant, and I mean a giant coal vein. And we won't remove the very top block. We're not going to do that. Okay, so there's two super chats. The first one is from Minato Namazaki. Na Namikaze. I'm so sorry. Okay. Minot, Minato Namikaze. I'm so bad. I'm so bad at pronunciation. But Minato, thank you for your super chat. It's, that could still be wrong, and I'm sorry if I pronounce it wrong. But they said, Neo, I love your videos. Can I have a shout out? Shout out to Minato Namikaze. I, ho I hope I'm saying your name right. And if I don't, if I'm not, if I'm saying it completely wrong, I do apologize. I hope you don't find any offense in that. I'm just bad at pronunciation. And Skater Mosher, welcome to another stream, and thank you for your super chat. You said, hello, 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 Neo. Well, welcome to the stream, and hello to you, too. I hope you enjoy your time spent here. Okay, so first order of business, I want to get a house built. Um, I really would rather have a bed, so I don't have to deal with the bad things at night, but I don't think I'm just going to, like, dig down and find iron really quickly. So we're going to have to suffer through the darkness for right now. Um, which I know for you guys it makes it a little bit dark, but I think we can manage. Just like that, just like that Michael Scott book. Uh, what is it? How I manage? Wait, what is it called? Somehow I manage. There it is. Somehow I manage. Okay, so we're gonna try to do a little bit of mining, I guess, since it's dark. Um, and I'd prefer for you guys to be able to, you know, do a little bit of that thing called seeing, because otherwise it's gonna be kind of difficult above ground to see. I mean, even for me it is. So I know it'll be for you guys. Look at that. I've made the achievement getting an upgrade. Oh my... Okay. Okay. See, this is what I'm trying to prevent, because I don't want to die again. Um, and if I were to die, that's okay. It's not that big of a deal. Oh my gosh. Why are there so many of you? No, what the... No, 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 no. Whoa, 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 now hold on, hold on, hold on. Where are you guys coming from? Where are you coming from? Oh, you're coming from up above where I just was. Wow, I'm smart. But why won't these guys move? There we go. At least blow up. Kill me if, if you're going to do something. They keep just, like, stopping right there. It's like there's an invisible wall. Well, either way, I'm going to collect this iron, and that's enough for shears, uh, which is enough, and that means I can make a bed. Because I feel like there's going to be just an absolute ton of mobs up here. So I might I might just refrain from going back up there until, well, it's day. Because, well, there's nowhere in the map for things to spawn. Meaning that everything's going to spawn in large quantities right there. Oh, there's no sheep down here. There are no sheep underground. <laughs> Maybe I should have thought of that. But you know what? I It's okay. I didn't think of it. But, oh, oh, okay. Ooh, okay. An elytra? No, no, hold on here. Wasn't that one of the challenges? I lost the challenge book, unfortunately, in a boating accident. We have an elytra now, but I don't want to put it on because, I mean, if I put that on, it's just not going to work, right? You know, I'm going to I'm gonna run out of durability on it. I need to get mending, I guess. Ugh. Minato Namikaze, Neo, what advice do you have for an MC YouTuber? Thank you for your super chat. Uh, what advice? I would say do something unique, which I know is very ambiguous, but you really do have to do something unique if you ever want to grow. Um, as like a Minecraft content creator, especially because that's like one of the most competitive things you can try in the gaming field on YouTube. Uh, and what I did was I did tutorials, so that drove traffic to my channel because people had to search. If you can tell, I love these kind of questions, but people had to search. You, 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 
So like, okay, people go on YouTube and, and all the time they're like, how to build a cave house in Minecraft. People will type stuff like that all the time, right? So I would just, I would fulfill that need. I would go on YouTube, I would type in how to build, and then I would do a tutorial based on what popped up. And uh, those search results drove traffic to my channel, and then people subscribed. That's that's literally it. So it sounds simple. It's not, but that's what you can do or try to do. Um, but there's a bunch of other things. You don't have to do tutorials, but at least do something unique that you can only find on your channel. Otherwise, you're never going to grow because... People people just don't want to watch smaller YouTubers. Some people do, but the majority want to watch a bigger established YouTuber just because, I mean, their content's... Are you serious? Their content will probably be better, only because... Yeah, see what I mean? Like, there are too many mobs up here. Holy crap. Did you guys see that? I know it was kind of dark, but, like, guys, there were, like, an immense amount of mobs. Like, like, like... Oh my god, we gotta block that off. <laughs> I don't know if you guys caught a glimpse of it. I mean, it was very quick. It was it was gone like that because I saw that and I ran away. So if we go back up there right now, we are gonna get we're gonna just get shot by skellies, exploded. We're just gonna stay down here for the time being. Like I said, until it becomes nice. I can't even go back up there. I already have my shears, right? Yes. I can't go back up there quite yet. That's not gonna work out in my favor, I can guarantee you. So we're just going to stay down here and we're going to do a little bit of mining, whatever that means, on this map. We're just going to look around. Because um, I saw another creeper and like, that's fine. Creepers aren't too hard. I don't know why there's so many, but there's a good bit of creepers. I keep forgetting I don't have armor. That's why I keep dying like that. Okay. Yeah, oh, <laughs> I see diamonds. That's the thing. Like, like this map I don't think is going to take a super, super long time to kind of play and beat. But, it, but it, it, it's a fun survival map, and it's definitely unique, because as you saw in the thumbnail, it's a giant fork. Um, so I'm excited we can explore all the biomes. They're all right next to each other, so it's hard not to. Um, I also, I hear a bunch of mobs, and I'm going to try to be very careful, and I'd like to make... Whoa. Whoa. You hear him? Is, it a, is this a zomba spawner? Probably. Monado Namikaze, thank you for another super chat. You said, last question, how did you get your name? So, when I first made this channel, the intention was to show... So, I used to play with these magnets, right? They were spherical magnets. They were strong neodymium, little tiny bead-looking magnets. And there were a bunch of them in a set, and I bought them. They were called the Neo Cube. And I got really, really good with, you know, sculpting with them, making stuff. And I wanted to make a channel to show off my creation. So, I did, and I named it the Neo Cubist. Um, only because the name of the magnets were the Neo Cube. So, I put EST on the end. Or ST on the end, and I guess the rest is history. Now we're here. But yeah, <laughs> that was the original intention of my channel. I didn't start this off as a Minecraft channel. The first, like, ten videos were magnets, oddly enough. Oh, wow, okay, so that's a... That's a... What do you what do you call those things? Oh, gosh, dude. Okay. What do you call these things? Monster boxes. <laughs> that's what we're going to start calling mob spawners. We're gonna call them monster boxes, because it sounds so much cooler, right? Okay, come on. I hear a baby zombie, but I don't think it's in here. No, okay. Okay, so we can make a mob farm, which is very helpful. There is a diamond in here that's much better than the normal dungeon loot. Do you guys think the normal dungeon loot is, like, bad? I really feel like it is bad, um, only because they're not very common. And you find better loot in a mine shaft, which doesn't really make sense to me. Um, but I feel like they... Oh, okay, these bats. These bats are going to kill me. Come on, we're going to kill you now. Come on. Yeah, sorry, guys, I know. They make a cute noise, but they're so annoying. There's a thousand people here now, so welcome all to the stream. Hope you're enjoying me watch... Hope you're enjoying watching me. And hope you are enjoying... Watching me play on a giant fork. I don't know why I can't just use basic English right now, but something about it is uh, it's too complicated right now. Okay, so as you can see, there is the sun about to come up, so we can go back up pretty soon. Uh, but like I said, uh, I'm gonna 
I heard something fall. I think that's a baby zombie. I don't want to check. Oh, that's right. No, I plugged the hole up. Never mind. Never mind. I'm going to put up almost everything because I don't want to die and just lose all my stuff again. So we're going to put it all in here. That way I only lose some tools. I'm going to make a pickaxe. We're going to get these diamonds right here, which is kind of funny that we're going to start off. We're going to skip pretty much. Uh, the only reason we're getting an iron pickaxe is so that we can get these diamonds. I don't know how many there are. I don't know if they're a trap. I don't know if we're going to like... No. Hmm. Well, let's find out. As I'm curious to see if they're they're booby trapped or something, because I I I feel like that would be something this creator would do. Uh, by the way, guys, the the creator of this map is called Sandbox Guy or Scythe Brian, something like that. And uh, they do have a YouTube channel, so if you guys wouldn't mind checking them out, link in the description. Uh, you know, they didn't like pay me to do that or anything. It's just they don't really have any views on their video showcasing this map. They have like maybe you can hear all of them die, and they have like maybe a thousand views on their video. And it makes me sad because this, like a map like this takes a lot of effort. And uh, I really would appreciate it if you guys would go and check out their uh, video. So link in the description. Go and check it out. You can also download the map for yourself by clicking that link. Um, in their video description is the link to download it. So, yeah. Go and check it out if you want. If you want. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back up to the surface. And we're going to try to build a home. But I'm also going to try not to die. It's nice to have an idol. It's nice to have an idol talk to you. Well, I try to talk to everyone, and I, I would just talk to everyone, but there's so many people here now that I can't and, because the whole stream would just be me. Well, it would just be me replying to chat, which is not what we're trying to. We're trying to stream the fork survival, but you know, like the limited number of super chats. You know, the people who super chat, I can handle that. But other than that, it's, it just gets too hard. It's not that I don't love you guys who don't donate. Don't get me wrong. I'm not going to love you anymore whether you donate or not. It's just I try to only, you know, have long, drawn-out conversations with the people who chat because or super chat because otherwise things just get a little... Oh! Things just get a little, uh, a little crazy. You get a little crazy. Thank you, Cecilia, for another super chat or super sticker. Or, oh! Oh! <laughs> it doesn't have to go like this, guys. It okay. Oh, you're going to try to shoot me through, like, this tiny gap, this tiny mini triangle? Oh, we're in a, we're in a sticky situation now, aren't we, guys? We have an apple. We also have this golden apple, but I don't want to eat that unless I really need it. Uh, we really need it. Here we go. Okay, we're going to eat that. We're going to kill this creeper. Here we go. Da -da -da -da. Oh no, that's a lot of creepers. Jeez, what is going? Get off the map! Get off the map! Ha ha ha! Get okay. So they don't. The mob griefing is off, thank God, because there's just so many mobs at night. It would be kind of crazy if it wasn't. Michelle Knowles, thank you for another super. Gosh, thank you for another super chat. Uh, go like this stream, by the way. Yes, if you guys haven't left a like on the stream. And uh, you notice you've been watching it for, you know, like five or ten minutes. If you wouldn't mind leaving a like on the stream, I really would appreciate it. It's not like it gives me money or something. And it's free for you to do. But uh, it just makes me... It, it's honest to God just good because it gives me feedback and lets me know you're liking what I'm doing. But if you don't like the stream, please do leave a dislike. I'm trying... You know, I always want to get feedback. I try to keep my ear to the community. So if you guys don't like it, let me know. Like, truly, I, you're not going to hurt my feelings or anything. Um, I really do want to know if you guys don't like something. I don't want to. I don't want to do something you guys don't like. There would be no point in that. Because um, after all, I'm making these for you guys. Okay, so I'm going to put these chests. I'm going to put some stuff in these chests. Just, just a little bit. Because, well, at least while we build a house, we cannot have a full inventory. It just doesn't work. Michael Rodriguez, thank you so much for your super chat. You said, "Hey, bro, I've been catching up on your survival series." I've only got 80 more episodes. Heck yeah. There's there's a lot of episodes in there. I don't know how we've made it this far. I never thought that I would have a series that's that far, but somehow some way we did it. I don't like I if I'm going to I'm going to build a house here. I can't have this map, but we can use all these item frames. Um but yes, thank you for your super chat. I appreciate it, Michael. Thank you. And uh yeah, good luck on catching up. <laughs> that's a lot of episodes to watch. Uh, luckily I upload like four a week, so it won't take that long to catch up. If you just watch, you know, a couple, a couple a week, it won't, you know, 
just take like 80 weeks, right? <laughs> Skater Monster, thank you for another super chat. Uh, what's been your favorite series? Mine was Falling Falling. Mm, I have to say my favorite series, honestly, is the Survival Let's Play we're on right now. And only because so many other people love it. Uh, and I love it too. It's, it, it, it's just been crazy. I've been getting like almost 100,000 views on every episode um, for the past week or two, which is not normal for my channel at all. So it's been really like hyped up and... I don't know. It's been a lot of fun, and I've I've liked getting to go underground and staying above ground, all that fun stuff. But yeah, thank you for your super chat. And I do miss falling, falling sometimes. Maybe maybe we'll revisit it in the future. Michael, I'm gonna donate again just because you're a pretty cool guy. Well, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate any and all donations. Thank you guys so much. Uh, Minato Namakazi, thank you for another super chat. Neo, can you do a tutorial on mob spawners? You could go and watch episode, I did that creeper spawner, which I mean, I get is not like the same thing at all, but if you want to see like some sort of tutorial, I'm pretty sure I have one on my channel maybe, so you could try looking it up on there, but um, I'm sure there's other YouTubers out there that have done it. I'm just not very, I'm not very keen on doing tutorials anymore just because I've done so many in the past that like, I don't know, just the thought of it almost like stresses me out too much and I don't want to do it just because I've done so many. And I feel like I got really good at it, and I feel like if I did a tutorial now, it would be absolute garbage. And I just, I don't know. But maybe in the future. But thank you for the suggestion, and thank you for the super chat. Okay. I'm trying to clear a little bit of an area out. I guess we're just going to build a house, like, over here. I know, it's in the most basic biome. There is a jungle on the very back of the handle. Sorry, I had to sneeze. There is a jungle. Well, I guess it's literally right there, so we're almost at the back. Uh, we could live in this house, but that's already built. That's no fun, right? We're going to try to build something really wacky. Maybe we'll build a giant spoon home. I don't know. Just one second, guys. I know it's muted. Hold on. All right, let's build a house. I'm just going to be, I'm going to try to be different with this build. I don't know what I'm going to do exactly, but I'm going to try to make it as weird as possible. But to be fair, I don't really have too many trees. Um, I don't really have that many at all, but we're going to try our absolute best here. We got a lot of flowers too, which is a big plus. So we'll put these all over here. And... No, we don't have any more saplings in here. We can, however, go and preemptively build a bed. Did I grab my shears? Yes, they're already in my inventory. Let's go over here and find these sheep. Um, I thought there was some... Well, maybe they're not over there anymore. I don't know. They're somewhere. We're going to go and find them. There they are. Hopefully one sheep will just give us three wool, but I don't know if that's like really rare. I don't know. That probably won't happen, but let's see how many wool we can get. One wool. Okay. Yep, one wool. That's all. Yeah, come on, sheep. One wool. Okay, Wait, that one gave us two at least. Two at least. Monado, thank you for another super chat. Was going to buy some chips, but now I'll just use cash. <laughs> okay, well, sounds good, but thank you for the super chat. I hope you still get your chips, though. It's always a, you know, it's always a good feeling to get some chips, you know, just because the crunch. Mm-hmm. It's always a good idea, right? Uh, we're going to have a yellow bed. I can't say I've had a yellow bed in the last time I can remember. Ooh, thank you for the huge super chat, Michael. I appreciate it. How far do you plan on going with the Survival Let's Play? Uh, pretty much as far as I can go. And I, I know that's a very ambiguous answer. And yes, I just started using the word ambiguous a lot because, you know, I'm just so fancy. But no, I, I really don't know. Um, basically, if I ever get really bored, I'm not going to continue doing it. I'll probably either start a completely new world or I'll try you know a custom map like this or something uh, but I think I'm gonna always have like a staple survival let's play going in my world I honestly do uh, just because it's been doing so well and there's like infinite things you can do in a survival world so in my honest opinion like for the series we have going right now I can't really ever see it ending I'd love to get in the thousands of episodes and I want to I want to stay on the same world so I hope they don't add anything in like the world gen. You know, I want to keep this map, you know, for five or six years and see how far we can get. 
you know, and start, you know, start over, obviously, you know, like every 100 episodes or something, just go in a random part of the map and start over like we've done underground and like we will do when we go back above ground. But we will go back and look at all the fun stuff that we had built in the past. Um, but I definitely plan on starting over again once we get back above ground because I don't know. I don't want to just do what I've always done. I, I don't want to go back up and have everything again. I'd rather start over. I feel like that's more fun. But I hope that's a good answer, and thank you for your super chat. Will you do a hardcore survival Let's Play? Thank you, Itchy Butt, for your super chat. Interesting choice of name there. Um, will I ever do a hardcore survival Let's Play? I don't know, because I, it, part of me doesn't want to ever do that, because the second you die, you lose your world. And it's like, if the series is doing really well, you know, obviously you want to upload more of that. But you can't if you die. So it's, I guess that's a lot of pressure. But at the same, at the same time, the stress from that, I don't know. I'm I'm gonna answer that with a solid maybe, maybe, because I I honestly don't I I don't know. But thank you for the super chat. I appreciate it. Hermitcraft, yeah, Hermitcraft. So people always tell me, Neo, you you need to join Hermitcraft. And the thing about Hermitcraft is they are invite only. You can't just like you know join them or whatever. What happened to the storms that were going to hit us? They just, like, disintegrated like they always do right over us. That's sad. I love I love lightning storms. Lightning storms. I just like thunderstorms, okay? I think they're, I think they're fun because, the, you know, loud noises and stuff, I guess. I don't know. I've just always enjoyed, enjoyed them. A good vibe they give off, I guess. I'm just trying to get some materials for the home here. I'm not trying to bore... Ooh, I'm not trying to bore you guys or anything. Um, I just really want to get a couple, a couple of cobble, you know. A couple of cobble. So there's a ton of cool stuff to explore around this map. If you guys didn't see, there's like a big, well, there's like six big things. And there's also some more hidden things. So I'm kind of curious to try to find everything. Um, it's definitely going to be an interesting stream. That's all I got to say. We're not going to finish the map on this stream. Um, that would be impossible. But maybe eventually. Maybe eventually. <sighs> okay. Okay. Let's go back up. Is it night? Oh, no, 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 no. Please tell me mobs didn't spawn yet. Oh, thank God. How can you handle my videos at like 1.5 speed? I feel like that would be like, hey guys, what is up the new keeps here? Welcome to the Minecraft tutorial. Today I want to show you guys how to build up. You know what I mean? Like that would be so fast. But hey, props to you for being able to understand me when I, you know, on like that kind of speed. That's pretty cool. I've never heard anyone tell me they watch all my videos at a high speed. Uh, but you know what? Props to you for being able to. I don't think I could. That was a pretty cool kill right there. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. So we're going to try to, like, like I said, I'm going to try to, I know I've said this a million times. I'm going to try to build something unique. I don't know... You know, because there's like a thousand people watching, so I'm trying not to, you know, build something that just looks like total garbage. Uh, but it might turn out to be just, well, total garbage. So we'll see here. We'll see. Okay, let me just copy this structure over to here. So one, two, three, up, one, two, three, over, up, over, and then over. Okay. Okay. Do we have any food or anything? We need to go plant some stuff. We're just going to end up dying real quick here, aren't we? Where is some water? Where is some water? Just right over here. Okay. I don't mind having my farm around around a nice... Okay. Why are you here? That's Why are you here? That's the better question. What are you doing? Did a zombie just fall out of that tree? What the... What are you doing to this poor sheep? Stop it. No, oh, I don't want to hurt the sheep. Yes, we are very, very close to toast here. If this spider hits us, we're done for. I don't know where all these mobs just came from, but you know what? Sounds good, I guess. We're going to plant a little bit of wheat. See how much we can get. There we go. Nice. A seedy place. Cool. Okay. So that should be... You know, that that that's not like a, you know, a large amount of wheat, but... It's a, it's enough to put bread on the table, for right now at least. Is there something in here? I don't know if we've been in here or not. No, we hadn't. I love how you can get in these houses. You just have to crouch now. Oh, okay. So it's really nothing. Okay. Right? No. 
I don't I don't need any of that right now. If we really need some food, I guess we really do need some food. Uh, you know what? Because we're so stupid and didn't realize that, I'm just going to eat rotten flesh. And I'm going to stand still and read the chat a little bit. So hello, chat. Thank you for watching. There's 1,500 of you here. Welcome to the stream. Um, hi, I just joined. Welcome to the stream. Cool. Am I late? No, nah, not really. It's only been like 30 minutes. You suck. Oh, wow. That's creative. Hi, Neo. Hello. Hi, hi, Fork. Hi. How you doing? Hi. What is your PC specs? You mean my specs? I got an i7 8700K and a GTX 1070 Ti. Hi. Can you read this? Sure. Oh, man. Oh, no. Why? I started reading the chat and everyone's like... <laughs> Cole, thank you for your super chat. I appreciate you, Cole. Uh, love the videos, Neo. Would you consider doing an all-underwater base build next? Keep up the good work. That might be a really fun thing to do. Maybe we'll do an underwater survival at some point. That could actually be pretty fun. Thank you, Cole, for your super chat, though, and for your suggestion. I really appreciate it. Hey, I just wanted to say thank you for keeping me entertained during quarantine. You're welcome, guys. I'm, again, I'm happy to make content. I, I enjoy doing it, so it's really it's not a problem at all. I really do enjoy it, and it's my job. So, you know, I, I got to do it because I got to put bread on the table, just like our wheat farmer is going to do, I suppose. Man, the chat is going crazy, all because I just said I'm going to read the chat. You know, I'm never reading the chat again. Okay, we need to cut it off right there. Okay, so from this block over. We have a diamond pickaxe. What am I doing? <laughs> I'm so all over the place. Hold on. We're, we're going to do a big organize here. Hold on. There we go. That is so organized, right? Okay, so we have a sword. Uh, we don't have any more iron, so yeah, stone sword is fine. Then a pickaxe and this. Do we have a shovel? No, we're going to make an iron shovel. Uh, we also have another pickaxe. We will keep that in our inventory. I see the super chat. One second. I'm on a roll here with this this sorting. Silver Wolf, 1999. Thank you for coming into another stream. You are such a longtime fan. It always makes me so happy to see you on the streams. Thank you for joining. Hi, Neo. My new PC is coming in Wednesday. I'm super excited. How are you doing? Ooh, that's really exciting. It's gonna be pretty fun. What'd you get? Did you get like a, a like a computer, like a gaming computer, or like a school computer, something for work, uh, the school work and stuff? Either way, exciting. And thank you for the super chat. Um, and I'm doing pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Can't complain, right? Can't complain. Um, Noo, thank you for your super chat. You said hi. Well, hello to you, Noo. And thank you for your super chat. I appreciate your support. Welcome to the stream. I don't think I've seen you around before. I mean, there's always a chance that, you know, you just watched and uh, not super chatted. Very, very possible. But either way, thank you for joining the stream and thank you for super chatting. Okay, I'm trying to get a little bit of seeds here. Just a little bit of seeds here. Come on. 16 seeds. Can we get can we get a couple more? Can we get like Can we get a couple more? No. Okay. Well, you know what? 16 seeds is more than enough. I really hope the creator of the map sees this because that would make me happy because I'd love to see them see me play. I feel like that would be kind of fun if you made a map and you could watch someone play it. Okay, we never finished this. I know I'm all over the place, guys. I know. I know, I know. But it's going to be... If we're going to try to do an interesting house, like I've said like four times. Uh, hopefully it turns out to be something of a dream. No, we're not building a giant spoon. <laughs> that would be kind of funny, though. Kind of kind of meta, I guess. We could build a giant spoon. You know what? We're going to build a giant... No, I'm kidding. We're not building a giant spoon. Who do you think I am? Okay. So we don't really have a whole lot of cobblestone, meaning that we can't really finish this right now, but at least we can do an outline on one side, right? Okay. We can't do it on the other side just quite yet, but we will get enough enough cobblestone. So we're at midday. We're just going to go mine a little bit more in our mining ravine. This is definitely not a ravine. Our mining area. We're just going to mine a little bit. How am I? I'm doing pretty good. How about you? A multiplayer series on Bedrock Edition. Um, I don't have Bedrock Edition. I guess technically I have the Windows 10 Edition, which is Bedrock, so maybe I do. It's a high-performance custom gaming PC. Oh, heck yeah. That, the, there are so many options. Once you get a gaming computer, so many options. You, see, I mean, you can buy an Xbox and you, know, you can play games at 30 FPS or whatever. But then you, you, you get a gaming PC... And your eyes open. 
you can see the whole world. Not really. But either way, I'm very excited for you, and I'm sure you're already extremely... I know when I get excited, I can't sleep. So, like, if it's the day... Oh, okay. We gotta not make sure we don't die here. <laughs> like, usually the day before I get something that I... That's why I really hate ordering things online, because I just think about it until the day it gets there. And maybe that's how everyone is, but it's, like, it's not stressful. It's just, like, I can't think of anything else. I'm just, like, excited to get what I ordered. But, yeah, I'm very excited for you. And thank you for another super chat. Thank you so much. James Hall, welcome to another stream. Thank you for another super chat. You said, yay, I finally caught a weekday stream. Hello, Neo. Hello, James. Welcome to the stream. I haven't done a weekday stream in a while, I don't think. I honestly can't remember. I tried to do it in the evening for, because, you know, like half of my viewership is from the United States. So I tried to do it in the evening. I feel like more people have time. No more Zoom class or Zoom meetings in the evening. I hope you're not working at 6 p.m., but if you are, that's okay. You can watch, you can put your AirPods in, right? <laughs> and you can just listen and not tell your boss that you're listening to a Minecraft person to talk about Minecraft stuff while you're getting paid on the clock. Don't try Fortnite. You see, I played Fortnite quite a bit when it first came out, but once they added, like, you know, sea doos and all this junk to the game, like everyone else, I was out of there. Um, I'm trying to read this name. Corrida... McSiffy, Corrida, McSiffy. I I can't say your name, and I'm so sorry. But thank you for your super chat. I appreciate you. Uh, Corrida, Corrida, McSiffy. I don't know how to say that, but thank you for your super chat. I'm so sorry. Sometimes I just read a name, and I'm like, I can't do this, and I just give up. But I tried Corrida McSiffy, something like that. But thank you for your super chat. You guys have been so generous today. Thank you guys all so so much. I really do appreciate it. I really really do. Okay, we're going to build and do the same thing we did on the other side. Dylan F Forrester? Forrester. I, see, that I thought it said Forrester, like the Subaru Forrester. But no, it says Forrester. Yeah, Forrester. Thank you, Dylan, for your super chat. Hey, Neo, I'm a big fan, and you give me a lot of inspiration in my own Minecraft world. Well, hey, I'm, ha I'm glad to be of inspiration to you, and thank you so much for your viewership. If it wasn't for you guys watching me, I, I mean... Obviously, I would make videos for no one, so I, I owe it all to you guys. So truly, thank you guys so much. Um, I do see there's a bunch of super chats. I'm just trying to get this done before night because I don't want to die. I don't think I'll be able to, actually. Oh, X-Ray, Lamb Feast Man, welcome to another stream. Hello, how's it going? Also, hello from the Lamb Gods above. Well, welcome to another stream. Thank you so much for tuning in, X-Ray. It's always a pleasure to see you. You really are like the first person I remember from my streams. Um... If you were asking me, like, do you remember anyone from your streams? It's always like x Silver Silverwolf. Uh, I'm trying to think. The One. I don't know where The One went. They came on my streams. They'd always donate like five or $600, and then they just disappeared off the planet. If you're out there and you're just watching, don't donate. But welcome to the stream, The One. Um, Silverwolf, thank you for another donation. You said, Neo, I hope you're not working at 6 p.m. Me works till 10 p.m. almost every day. I wish it didn't work that late, but that's the reality of having two jobs. Yeah, I remember you telling me you had, you had three jobs at one point. So I hope you I hope you just down to two. That's probably better than three. But yeah, that would suck having to work that late. But thank you for the super chat, Silverwolf. I really do appreciate it. And uh, I Darcy, I Darcy, I Darcy. Thank you for your super chat, eighty three hundred. Welcome to the stream, and thank you for the super chat. I appreciate your donation. Skeleton, don't shoot me! Don't shoot me! You shoot the creeper. Oh my god. Okay. Well, that's <laughs> the sun killed it immediately after so I don't really have much armor we just have this one armor okay serious seriously oh and they spread the fire now the greatest feature they ever added to Minecraft the fact that zombies can give you their fire their on fireness can spread to you interesting interesting design oh dude did I make two shovels? why did I make that shovel if I wasn't gonna use it that's my question See, that's the only problem with making like a skyblock type map like this is that the mob spawns are just insanity. Like there are so, so many at night. They just have to, you have to prevent night as much as possible because otherwise you'll just get destroyed. Um, but you know, just the nature of the beast, just the nature of the beast. Uh, okay, so what we're going to try to do here is at least make somewhat of a normal kind of roof in here. 
And then from the exterior, you know, you can't even tell that it... Yeah, you can. You know what? Maybe we should just fill that over and not use slabs. Yeah, we're, we're just going to do that. We're just going to do that. Why don't you stream on Twitch? Because uh, all my audience is here on YouTube, and I feel like... I, I don't know. I just don't want to have to build another audience on another platform. And I also don't want to annoy people and be like, hey, come to Twitch. I'm streaming there. But I guess a lot of YouTubers do that, so maybe I should at some point. I don't know. I do not know. I really don't. You'd think I'd know, but I don't know. It's so painful to build with half slabs. <laughs> it's like just building half, building half is slow. You have to place blocks twice as much. You know what? We're not going to be wasteful with our materials here. We have just a few slabs left. Just a few slabs left. There we go. Okay, so now we can just use normal materials. So I was grabbing a little bit of sand so that I could hopefully make some glass so that we could hopefully have some windows in our base. Uh, that way it's not just a solid cobblestone weird thingy. Again, I don't really know exactly what I'm building, but this is my first home and we're just going to... At least we have a first home. Sometimes I don't end up getting a first house until like the second stream. Um, so you know what? We're already on track to be successful with this map supposedly uh, for all of you who are new to the stream and haven't been here uh, very long uh, there is a link in my description to the YouTube channel showing off this map the creator and his name is sandbox guy he made a YouTube video and it only has like a thousand views and it's showing off this map he created the map and that was like his you know preview of the map so if you guys would wouldn't mind going and showing him some love on his channel I really would appreciate it because I know how hard it is being a con especially a map creator you don't get that much love and like this took a long time to make like it really did so go and show him some love and i would really appreciate it and uh yeah thank you guys so much for those of you who choose to do that so i'm just gonna grab i guess we already have a good bit of sand we may not need more than this i may have preemptively grabbed a little bit too much but that's okay we'll just do we'll do three furnaces and you know what we can just Sure, that's fine. We need to get some walls going, though, before too long. I really think walls... Walls are definitely a good idea. We also don't have that much coal. Oh, no, we actually do have a good bit of coal. Um, we just need, like, four for that many. Because technically, yeah, four is perfect. Okay. So, almost all of our coal is gone, but that's okay. We're going to put the rest into torches... That's probably going to be the best course of action. I'm going to move the bed. Again, I don't know exactly how this house is going to be in the future, so I'm just going to probably not going to have um, this on the floor. Though We're going to do a wooden floor in here, something like that. And the walls, this again, this is just the roof. So we'll try to do the walls as some other material, but we don't really have anything. We have a few oak logs. I guess that's pretty decent pretty decent hmm I'm just trying to find where I should put supports because uh, I don't want it to look weird that's honestly perfect okay yes we can do that uh, so there's a flat moon over there we can go and explore there's all these fun stuff to explore I know you've probably seen it in the background you're wondering like what is all this stuff there's like a giant floating bee over here pretty cool there's a ton of just really cool stuff on this map, so they spent a lot of time on it, so I really would appreciate it if you'd go and show him some love. Again, link in the description to the video he made showing it off. I cannot believe there's 2,500 people here watching me play on a giant fork, but welcome to the stream, guys. If you're watching this video after the fact and you notice you've been watching for a while, please do subscribe. Only 25% of my viewership, even after me mentioning it all this weekend, is subscribed. Like, 25% of the people who watch me are subscribed. The other 75% of you, what are you doing? You don't have to subscribe if you don't want to, but I really would appreciate it. Uh, something 0102, thank you for your super chat. You said, you said bum snack. Huh. I don't know. You're talking about a bee? The moon? What are you talking about? Either way, something 0102, thank you for your super chat. I appreciate your support. Thank you so much. I almost don't want to break this little fallen over tree. It looks really cool, but... You know what? We need the wood. So I'm just going to break down this tree because these honestly give you so much. And I really love dark oak, so why not? Why not? 
have all the blocks you need but one yes the truest struggle that seems to be the case when i build a house i'll have everything i need except for one more of the certain block and i have to go back and make it hopefully we can do the best two pounds i ever spent <laughs> is it did i say something funny because i just didn't get it if i did maybe i'm too old maybe the fact that i said I honestly don't know. <laughs> is that does it sound bad or something? I don't think so. Huh. Well either way, thank you for the super chat. Even if you tricked me to say something bad, I still appreciate the super chat. Okay, we'll just collect this one and we'll call it good. Because I don't want to spend the whole time just collecting resources. I want to do a little bit of exploring. Uh Livy Weaver, thank you for your super chat. It's either Live I, which is probably not it. It's probably either Livy. Livy, right? Livy, I know Weaver, but Livy, I think. But thank you for your super chat. You should do. Uh, they said you should do a Skyblock Mac map. Pixel Rifts does a Skyblock for 1.16. Message me on Discord if you want the link to the map. Um, I may do a Skyblock map. We'll see. But thank you for your super chat and uh, thank you for the offer. I really do appreciate any and all help. So thank you. We may do a Skyblock. Who knows? Not me. You'd think I'd know, but I really don't. I really don't. I know very little. I'm trying to get. A, I want to make sure to get these saplings. Remind me to get the dark oak saplings, please, because I don't want to like leave those there and just not have any more. That would be, well, it would be a shame. It truly would be. I'm gonna go find. I had an iron hoe, right? Nope, stone. That's fine too. We're just gonna. Do I have enough iron to make a bucket? No, I don't. Jay Z, thank you for your super chat. Thanks for this surprise stream. Of course. Just felt like streaming, so uh, we hopped on a stream. You know, it's interesting, this map is. You know, I've said it like a billion times, but this map really is very unique. That's why I keep harping on you guys showing this map creator some love. Because people like this honestly keep the YouTube community as well as the actual like game community alive. Uh, without these creators, YouTube wouldn't be... Or without these map creators, Minecraft YouTube would not be as good as it is. Uh, just because there wouldn't be enough content. Uh, but these kind of people, they really do keep the game alive because without them, there would be, well, no content for us YouTubers to record on. Um, so that's why I encourage you guys to show them some love. We don't want these people to go away. They put in so much work and they help out so many people, so many more than I think they realize. And they really do deserve some love and they don't, they don't get enough. They really don't. That's why I keep, that's why I keep saying like, please go and check this person out because they probably spent a long time on this. JJJJ, sir, thank you for another super chat and for coming into another stream. You said keep on keeping us. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Is that a tongue twister? Keep on keeping on and keeping us entertained. Okay, no, it's not a tongue twister. I'm just a moron. But thank you, JJJ, sir, for the super chat, and uh, I will do my absolute best. It's a lot of pressure coming from JJJJ, sir, so I'll do my absolute best. But thank you for your super chat and your support. I really do appreciate it. Again, I will try to keep you entertained, but there's always a chance that I will fail. And uh, I will not entertain anyone. You never know, guys. You never know. You just never know. Levi Weaver. It is Live Buckeye Live You Dig Cap Server. Oh, okay. Well, thank you for coming on to a stream. And thank you for your support. Now I know who you are. I just can't, for some reason, when I see all these names on here, even if I've talked to this person before, it just escapes me. I, I I can't do it. But yes, thank you for your support and your super chat. Okay. W wait. Where are we going to... Okay. We're just going to put the... We're going to put the bed down and we're just going to sleep. Because I really don't want to deal with all these mobs. I really don't. Yes, I know I'm standing still. I already know the chat's going to be like, Neo, it's frozen. No, it's not. It's never frozen. Never, ever, ever. I'm going to try to get some more dirt so we can make this. I guess we can only make it three blocks bigger. But you know what? That's that's good. That's good. Okay. One, two, one, 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 two, three. That was four. I said one, two, three, but put four down, didn't I? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Dark Oak Sapling. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
See, I would have totally forgotten. The chat, you guys just saved me, and I really appreciate you guys. Who said that? Dark Oak Sapling. A bunch of you said it. A bunch of you said it. And I was going to shout out someone, but it, like a ton of people said it. But thank you guys. Did we at least get four? Yes, it looks like we got way more than just four. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, okay, so there's f oh, there's four. And is there any more? There we go. Cool. We got nine, so that's enough for two more, uh, which is absolutely perfect. That's how many I want, right? Uh, we will put them like, uh, put them right here, and put them right here. Cool. Uh, we do have a bunch of oh, just normal oak saplings. We'll just put those like that. Now, I don't know if the tick speed is increased from default Minecraft. Let me tell you. No, it is not. It's just default tick speed, so... That's fine. I'm fine doing that. Um, it is just going to take quite a bit uh, for stuff to spawn. Or I guess not spawn. I guess grow would be the proper terminology here. So I'm going to line the very bottom of this thing. I'm trying to think. Is this inside too small if we do it? Nah, it should be all right. So I'm going to put this right here. and We are going to do an outline made of these blocks just like this. And I'll try to make this look better in the future, but for right now, we're just going to be filling it in with a little bit of dark oak planks. This is how I like to start my builds. I'd like some more depth on the walls, and I think I can achieve that. I just need to do this part first. Uh, okay. So just keeping to this rule of having... There we go. Okay. So it looks like that on both sides of the four blocks, right? Yes, it does. Okay. So now we're going to take some of this, and we're just going to make the panes... Now, I don't know how many we're going to need, but we'll get two stacks to start with, and we'll just save the rest of the glass. I think two stacks... Oh, that's a big problem. That's a big oof. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. I don't know how to figure that out. I don't think that's possible. I think we're just going to have to deal with it being filled in, which looks bad, but we can fix it. We can fix it. I actually already have an idea. Okay. So for right now, it'll just have to be like that, and we'll just fill all this in with glass. Uh, we got to fill that in too. There's certain things that I just cannot do. Like if I'm making a build, there are certain rules I just I have to follow or else I just end up with something that I can't stand looking at. So obviously we can do two doorways right here. That's perfectly fine. Got to fill in that bad boy and then we're just going to fill these in. Uh, there we go. Okay, so the windows match. Everything's good, good. Uh, the only problem is, is that this looks a little weird, but fear not. I think I can make it look better. I just, my inventory is always so full. So many things. Uh, where's my crafting table? Okay, so we're going to make some of these guys. We're not going to make that many. We'll make that many, sure. And then we're going to make a little bit of fence. Now, not too much here. Not too much here. Just a good bit. A good bit uh, goes a long ways as far as fence goes. Okay, so that tree grew. That looks nice, right? Uh, we also need a couple of stairs, if you don't mind. There we go. Okay. So we're going to put a stair. Ooh, we're going to need a couple of doors, too. That's probably a necessity. Okay, so on the floors in here, I'm probably going to do oak wood. Um, but at least for the wall, I'm going to carry over that wall material to the floor. We're going to place the doors from the inside, so you can do those both at once. Break the top. Put an upside-down stair above to add depth and then we're going to do the same thing on this side if we didn't already we already did and then we're going to put some slabs and the most fun part and then we're just going to put some fence down like that and then yeah that's fine i actually really like that okay cool and then we're going to repeat the same thing on this side so how did i do it doom 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 no that's not right right wait yeah it was the opposite okay it was the opposite of what I did. Right? This, this, this. Yeah, and then I put the fence down. Okay. So we have a little bit of a roof. Now, obviously, the only thing I'm not too happy about is the cobblestone. So all I'm going to do to fix that, I think I might just expand the cobblestone out another block. I don't know. I'm worried because of this little overhang on the door. It's just, it's a little too... Hmm. This is going to be a problem. 
So now I don't like the house because I looked at it and I realized that it's all just flat in front. Oh, no. Let me stare at it and think of an idea. I also need to use the restroom. So I'll be right back. I'm not gone, I promise. All right, I am back. Let's hope I didn't scare anyone there. I always come back very abruptly. Ooh, a tree just grew literally right next to us. Well, good for us, I guess. Well, we could have died. Yeah, we could have died, couldn't we have? But well, we didn't. I guess that's good. It's always good to come back and know you're not dead. I suppose. I suppose. I suppose. If I speak properly. Okay, so we're going to do just oak wood flooring in here. I feel like that's a good choice. Always a staple. Oak wood floors or ceilings, one of the two. And I don't think we're going to add any more to the house right now. Because this entire time, we've been... Oh, there's 3,000 people here. Now, now hold on here. Now, hold on here. There are 3,000 people here? Hold on. i got to adjust my mic for that. I gotta make sure my voice is as crisp as humanly possible. We're gonna put push the pop filter so close to my microphone. Guys, welcome to the stream. How are there 3,000 of you here? How? That's what I wanna know. That's too many people, but thank you for choosing to watch me. I, why you're choosing to watch the guy who's playing on a giant fork, I do not know, but maybe it's because it's never before seen. But yeah, definitely go and check out, like I said, Sandbox Guy's channel. Its link is in the description to their video showing off they created this map. And uh, there is a video that I put in the link in the description. You should go and click on it and uh, show them some love. They only have like a 1,000 views in their video, so if we could get that to like 2,000 by the end of the stream, that would be really cool. So just click on it. You don't even have to watch it. Just click on it. Let's get them some views. That would really be, it would really be nice because they put a lot of work into this, guys. Like I said... All of these things are all like an explorable area. There's even a giant ship over there. You spawn in a giant plane. And he made this giant, just giant flat moon. There's just so much cool stuff. So definitely go and check it out. This is what I want to explore really badly. It's a bedrock. I'm almost, I keep falling, almost falling off the end. I don't know what it is. It looks like some sort of evil, some r slash evil buildings going on there. Oh, my pop filter fell. Can't let my P's and my T's be too loud. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> I just filled it in. I really don't mind my house. It's okay. I just, I wish it was better, but it's, it's, it's okay. It's not a big deal. We're actually going to put our bed in a proper spot now. We're not going to keep it in the middle of the floor. That's a no-no. Uh, we don't have any actual... We don't have any actual lighting materials yet. All we have are torches, so we're just going to do torches. And honestly, there's nothing wrong with torches. Um, I don't have a problem with them, but if I have lanterns, I'd you know prefer to use those. Uh, and there's probably a little bit of light on the outside, right? We can't just have this be completely dark. Although there's nowhere to put light on the outside, so we'll, we'll just ignore that for now. Now, we're, we're going to have to do something quite painful here. We are going to have to remove this chest. I need to build some more chests, though. Before I do that, I don't want to make this harder than it has to be. Do I have any extra chests? Yes. Okay. I'm trying to think, where can I put some chests? 
I can honestly put them in a big stack. Um, or I can do... Oh, this is actually perfectly sized. Okay, we'll do this. Because I don't think we're going to have like that much stuff. Again, the, this stream will probably be... There will probably be two of these episodes. It's not like this is going to be some huge series, I don't think. Just because there's not... I don't know. There's not you know an infinite amount of things to do. Eventually, we will hit the limit. I'm going to do a little bit of sorting, too. I promise. We're not just going to... We're not just going to have it like this the whole time, but for right now, I'm just trying to establish... Should I put the chest in there? Yes. Okay. We're going to sleep before things spawn, because they're going to spawn like crazy on this map. Alrighty, so there is a wandering trader. I don't know if... I think I, I went out and I saw him, but I didn't click on him. We're going to see what trades they have. Is it going to be bad? Probably, but I always... I don't know. I always feel weird if I miss their trades. Wow. Five emeralds for one sapling. Who do you think you are? Those bad deals are so bad. You're insulting me. Get out of here. Get out of here. I just need the leads. What do they give me? Leather? It's actually pretty good. The Manton Cuber. Thank you for your super chat. Someone else with cube in their name. How interesting. Uh, but thank you so much for your super chat. I love the wolf picture. Looks pretty cool, right? Pretty, pretty cool. Okay, so we're going to grab all the wood stuff. But yes, thank you for the super chat. And I hope you enjoy the stream. Um, we're going to have a wood chest be right here. Everything that has wood. That's pretty much all the wood stuff. And then we're just going to have a general... Oh, that didn't... I missed that. We're going to do just a general blocks chest. So just anything that looks like a block or comes from a block. We're just going to put it in here. It's a pretty good method for sorting. Let me tell you right now. Um, and this is not technically a block, but we're going to put it in there because it's like a building material. And then everything else we'll just throw in here, which is going to be a bunch of tools and junk. But that's fine. We don't really need, you know, again, this to be super organized. We're just trying to have some content, okay? We're trying to play a little bit. So we're going to go exploring. We're going to keep some wood with us. We don't have any food yet. Unfortunately, we have zero food. But we're going to go and check on our very own wheat farm. There might be something grown by now. Maybe. No. <laughs> There's absolutely nothing. That is a melon, though. That is a melon. That's four... No, it's like two hearts of health if it gives us... Wow, okay. One and a half... No, they give you one whole... One whole one each. I got melon seeds, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, sorry, sh sorry, sheep. The sheep got the short end of the stick there. That's unfortunate. Okay. Oh my god, there's 3,300 people here. Welcome all to the stream. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys are enjoying the stream so far. Oh! I know. I like. I looked away in real life. I like turned my head to the side. <laughs> that was kind of weird. I don't know why I did that. We will fill that in at some point. We're going to go do a little bit of exploring and figure out what this world is all about. I made it to the tip of the map, the tip of the fork where like, you know, the actual forks of the prongs of the fork are. And we fell in between them, and uh, we just died. So that wasn't too good. That was at the beginning of the stream. Luckily, we have not had such luck again. We have not died. and Well, we haven't died from falling, and I really hope I don't. Uh, but if you guys are watching my channel and you're not subscribed, click that click that bell and, and slam that bell. And, and let me know if you're subs... All right. Um, let's see. So there was a little cute shipwreck here. There's also some bamboo, which you know what, we're just going to take it. Sorry, sugar cane. People used to call them reeds, bamboo. I guess there actually is bamboo. People used to call these reeds, though. So we're going to grab the reeds. Okay, see, I almost I almost just fell off the map again. You want to know why? So when you look at this from the right angle, right, you just walk and you're not going to look down. But this is death. So you got to be very careful. So each one of these little forks. Ooh. I might go check that out. Um, each one of these, that's some ice. Each one of these forks is like, you know, part of the fork. Maybe there's something in here. No, come on. There's got to be something in there. Okay. I was going to say, there's nothing in there. That's like the perfect object. I love this map creator just because I feel like we'd get along very well. They knew exactly where to put this stuff. Ooh, the saber. Netherite scraps. A totem of undying. Ooh, okay. Can someone tell me how the Totem of Undying works? Because I don't know. 
I genuinely do not know. How does a totem of an undying work? Do I just keep it in my hand and when I die, it'll be like, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> you guys see it. Carlos Matos is screaming, Bic on that. <laughs> you, guys, you guys seen that? Oh, it's a cl- oh, my God. It's a classic. So I just hold it in my hand. Okay. 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 So there's a bell here pointing downwards. No, that's that's just too much. Uh, there's the tip of the map. There's something here, right? Probably not. Uh, let's go back over here. Okay, I, need, I almost did that jump. <laughs> I would have been sorely mistaken. <laughs> that would not have worked. Oh, thank you, Mom, for another super chat. My mom says hi to my grandkitties. Well, you can't see them in here, but they're... I don't know where they are. There's probably around Lauren or something. I have no idea. But I, I'm pretty sure they'd say hi back if they could. But I love you, Mom, and thank you for another super chat. I appreciate it. She loves the kitties just as much as we do. Just as much as we do. Uh, if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, feel free. It is just my YouTube username. So if you want to check out the cats or anything like that, um, you can do so by going on my Instagram and looking at them there. Um, yeah. And if it interests you, I feel like that's a trick. Okay, no, they're not. I was going to say, okay, that's the bottom. I was like, that would be kind of scummy to put some iron there. And if you mine it, you fall through the map and die. There is a cow here. I do want to keep that in mind. Oh, I need to stop doing these jumps. I need to start doing these jumps. Dude, what is that? What? What? <laughs> I just looked up and I'm like, what is that? <laughs> this is this map. This map creator, seriously, shout out to Sandbox guy. I know I've said it a billion times. Go check out their uh, showcase video in the channel. They have only they only have a thousand views. There are three thousand of you watching. If only a third of you went and clicked on the link in the description, the YouTube link in the description. And you went and checked out their video. I'm sure it would make their entire week. So thank you guys for those of you who did. And if you didn't, I also thank you for watching. Uh, Dream Drowdy, thank you so much for your super chat. You said, yo man, hey, what's up? Not a whole lot, just playing on a giant fork. We are on the prongs of the fork as we speak. Looking at a giant super cyber ship, which is cool. And then a Steve plane. <laughs> or No, sorry, a villager plane. Um, is there something down here? No, I guess, I don't know what I expected to be down there. Maybe in this, right? Oh, this is an igloo. Oh, okay. So it's like a little Eskimo hangout. Okay, we don't need these snowballs. Uh, look how fast. I can click. That's one thing about me is I can click very quickly. Uh, Ariane, Ar hold on. Look at that. So cool. We're just going to throw these off the edge. Okay, I'm going to try to pronounce this name, and I'm going to try my absolute hardest. Aranya? Sarkar, I hope I said that right, but thank you for your super chat. I really appreciate it, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the stream. I'm sorry I can't pronounce names. I wish I could. I just really can't. Oh, okay, so there's a chest under there. Okay, I dig that. That's nice. A honey bottle as well. Woohoo! Cool. I'll take the name tag. I hear zombies. Is there something down here? I mean, there has to be something down here because I hear zombies. We're gonna look even deeper. We're gonna we're gonna look even deeper. I hear it. Livy Weaver, thank you for another super chat. I hope I'm saying your I hope I'm saying your name right Oh my gosh. No! No, I don't wanna use my totem of undying because of a stupid creeper! Oh come on! That was the worst use of a totem of undying ever. A stupid creeper just, like, in a hole. <sighs> That's okay. Either way, thank you, Livy, for the super chat. Uh, this community makes me so happy I can't help but donate. Yeah, I feel like, you know, I mean, obviously I'm biased and I really like my community, but I feel like you guys are really, like, the sweetest group of people any creator could ask for. Like, you guys are always so kind. Um, of course, you know, there's always some people that aren't kind, but they get banned. Um, but yeah, I feel like everyone here is genu generally pretty nice to each other and pretty understanding of everything. 
um, whatever that really means, but people are pretty nice here. And uh, thank you, Livy, for a super chat, another super chat. And uh, I hope you enjoy, I hope you're enjoying the stream. I know I am. I'm having a ton of fun with all this, well, not all this death. I wish I didn't waste my totem of undying like that. That's like the best. I just can't believe, I can't believe I wasted that. Those are so rare. <laughs> okay, so below this candy cane, is there anything? No. That's okay. I keep looking for like little secrets, but I guess I need to realize that not everything is going to have a little secret. That's where coal was. Ooh, I did see something that I wanted to explore, and I remember saying something about it. Okay, then now that noise is uncomfortable. I don't know if you guys just heard that, but that is uncomfortable. That is very uncomfortable. Michelle Knowles, thank you for another super chat. Rip, dumb creeper, I agree. That was a very dumb creeper, and I'm sad that we lost, like... Ow. I'm sad that we lost our totem after getting it and having it for like t <gasps> We gotta get home. Oh no, I'm not gonna get home fast enough. Oh no. Oh god. And, I, and I'm never gonna. I'm not gonna be able to sleep tonight if I don't get home before uh, all the mobs spawn because they're not gonna. They're just gonna be too close to the house. And I'm not gonna be able to sleep, and it's gonna make this so bad because it's gonna be so dark. Um, I love this map. That plane. I know it's funny. This is a plane crash on a giant fork, and we're screwed. Yep. Dang it, we waited too long. Oh no. Please, 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 please don't spawn anything. Come on, Minecraft. You know you love me, right? You love me? You're not gonna you're not gonna put any spawns. Please come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, please, please, please. Oh thank god. I was so worried. So worried. Now you're saying what on earth is a fork Minecraft? Well let me tell you right now, I have no idea. This person thought of this map, and I'm not sure how. The sandbox guy or Scythe Brian, they thought of a giant fork, and they made it into a survival map. And it's also surrounded by it as a bunch of really cool stuff. But definitely go and check out their channel. Link is in the description. You really should click on that video. I, I, I know it would make their week, because they only have a thousand views on their video. And you can let you can let them know I sent you if you want. But they only... Oh, you killed the sheep? That's collateral damage. You didn't need to do that. Ah, oh, stupid creepers. Ruining lives since 1992, right? How old are creepers? I don't know. Does anyone truly know? Probably not. Okay, so I'm hearing some stuff, and there's some gravel here, which is really suspicious. This is some suspicious gravel. Okay, well, suspicious I need not be because there's nothing there. There is something down here, though. Yes, there is something down here, though. Okay, I need to get... Do I have enough iron yet? Oh, I have this thingy. Okay, we're going to try this thing out. Michelle Knowles, thank you for another super chat. I meant that villager head plane so inventive. Oh, yes, yes, yes. It is a very interesting choice. I'm, I'm just telling you, this map creator really does deserve some more love. I don't think... I don't think they're getting enough because... Oh, well, you can't see the plane. It's not loaded in. I can make it load in. I, I'm just saying, guys. <laughs> I mean, like, what is that? And like, those propellers are really well done, too. I just I know I keep shouting this person out, but seriously, I mean, they're making the map I'm playing on, and they really do deserve some more love on YouTube. They, they just, they're not getting that many views, and they need more, because this is absolutely incredible. This is, like, the best custom map I've played in a long, long time. Definitely the most unique. And nowadays, it's just a variant on Skyblock. Actually, no, Falling Falling, I think, was crazy. It was crazy in a different way, though. Why is this doing no damage? It's like enchanted really heavily. What? It's already halfway dead. I guess it's not enchanted heavily. It only has sweeping edge too. Okay, well don't listen to me. What do I know? What do I know? Come on, please have a big fat diamond vein. No, just... Well, actually six diamonds is good, but I think I already had a few. Uh, yeah, we can throw some things off. We don't, we don't, we, we don't need a lot of this stuff. Uh, we shouldn't we shouldn't throw away too much stuff. We shouldn't throw away too much stuff. And I hear more skellies. I think they're somewhere over here. Oh yes, oh yes, they are. No. No, they're in this in this dungeon. Oh, okay, okay. They can't get out of here, right? No, they can't. Okay. I was gonna say I'd like to I'd like to mine my iron in peace. Until I get torn two pieces. 
potentially uh, by this dungeon. Uh, let's see. We, we'll grab the coal, too. It's an equally as important resource. We just need to eat before we go. I know I've seen some chats saying, Neo, please eat. They don't have a lot of food, but I think I have enough to at least get my health back up. Raw, raw. That's all raw. Uh, I have five of these. I have two potatoes, but I really want to plant those. Oh, I guess the sweet berries will fill me up, actually. There we go. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. See, what sucks is these, these sweet berries, their saturation is so low that even standing still and regening your health causes them just to go right back down. We're going to try... I want to get them to attack each other. There we go. Spider and skeleton can fight. There we go. Look at this. Now they're all fighting. Okay, there's a lot of things in there. Okay. We're not doing that right now. Uh, let me mark this. I mean, I'm sure I won't lose it. This map isn't too big, but we'll put a little marker down just so we remember to go in there and grab that loot. So let's go tend to our farm before we get destroyed again. I mean, we have one heart and no food. I mean, we have food, but we need to cook it. So we're going to go back to home base. I tried to make somewhat of a unique base. It didn't turn out like I thought. Whoops. It kind of turned out like garbage. You know what I'm going to do? Just cause It's seriously bothering me, guys. I have to do this. I'm going to remove this part. And I'm going to fix this whole thing. Okay. Because every time I walk over here, it's like I don't want to be near my house because it just upsets me. I'm so I'm so just perfectionist on these houses. I have to be... There we go. Isn't that like just a million times better? It really does... It, it, houses really do come down to just having the proper framing. Um, that looks whack. We're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. But we are we are gonna we are gonna continue uh, with you know having this stick one block outwards. That really does just make or break a build. And I think we need one more cobblestone than we have in our hand. That person was right when they're saying when you need one more block. I'm seriously I'm pretty sure that this is going to be one block short, um, only because we had 51 and we ended up at 25. There's no other way that can happen. Gravity Fox Jam, thank you for a, for a super chat. and Not another, but I, I don't think you have. But either way, thank you for your super chat. You said check out Gravity Fox. Yes, shout out to Gravity Fox. Go and check them out on YouTube. No, we're two blocks short. But thank you, Gravity Fox, for the super chat. I really do appreciate it. Thank you for the support. Okay. So, I think it's this is only necessary because we keep dying. We're going to make a diamond sword. We're going to make a um, going to make another iron axe because we're going to need that, and then we're going to make some boots. I know I'm going crazy here, but we're gonna we're gonna make a few boots here because uh, otherwise I feel like yes that gave us so much armor, and then we're gonna cook this stuff. We're just gonna throw it in there. That's probably not the bit. We'll just use the wood here. Nope, don't want to smelt that. Okay, we'll throw in that. Okay, so I'm going to go and plant these potatoes. I know we have no HP at all, so if we get shot once, we're just going to lose it. We're going to lose all of our stuff, so I'm trying my best here to not to not make that happen. These item chests are going to fill up very quickly because we're getting a lot of items. Not a whole lot of blocks. Not a whole lot of blocks. Uh, maybe we'll do a rare chest. Let me take out everything I perceive as rare. Netherite, probably. We need the potatoes with us. That's what I was going to do. I was going to make a bucket. <laughs> with those iron that way we could actually make a proper farm and we should probably get an iron hoe because we've been using a lot of that gravity fox jam thank you for another super chat you said i appreciate you for shouting me out well i appreciate you for donating if you if you donate i'll shout you out but yeah shout out to gravity fox jam go and check out their youtube channel and thank you for your uh, super chat i really do appreciate it guys all the support is very very much appreciated even if you're just watching, I appreciate you. Oh, I'm sorry to say this. Just as much as people who donate. Because um, I know a lot of people out there, you know, they can't afford to donate. Or they just can't. Or their parents don't let them. Or whatever the deal may be. And that's perfectly okay. Again, I'm not doing this for donations. I'm doing this just because I like streaming. And uh, I still make ad revenue off these videos. Because they get uploaded after the fact. So don't worry. Watching me is more than enough support. I promise. But thank you for uh, the support. Via watching or donating. 
Okay. Okay, so these vines, I don't know if they'll, like, mess up the plants on the ground. Okay, that is bugging me. But we're just going to try it anyways and see how well it works. So we have two potatoes. <laughs> we're just going to plant them right there. Maybe we have a little bit of extra wheat here. No? That's all that's grown this entire time is two? We've planted these like a long time ago too. May oh, we may have some bones. We may have some bones. And we also have a little bit of cooked fish we can grab now too. So hopefully that's enough food. Yes, it is. Heck yeah. Finally, not on a heart anymore. That always makes me so nervous. Uh, oh, we had we do have a lot of melon seeds. We're going to plant those ASAP because, well, it's just nice to be able to have food, right? Uh, and we can actually do something pretty cool. Just because, I'd, you know, when I try to plant stuff, I always try to make it look as fancy as I possibly can because I don't want to, like, redo things. So I always try to go big or go home, you know? Hey, look, a piece of wheat grew while we were complaining about the fact that our wheat didn't grow. Uh, and I can actually do something pretty cool here. Sorry to do that, but just so we can get up and down from the farm, that's going to be a little bit easier for us. Okay, uh, we can plant these seeds up here too. It doesn't really matter. There we go. So like I said, we're going to plant the melons now. So I was just going to do a row of them. We can just do... Trying to find a good spot for these melons here. Um, I really hate vines. That's like the biggest thing. They just I hate the vines right here at least. And I know this is temporary. If I break them, they're just going to come right back. But just to, uh, just to save my sanity here, we're going to do that for now. And I guess, honestly, we didn't need... Yeah, this will be fine. I'm just going to shave off a little bit of this land here. We're still going to try to make it look somewhat natural. Uh, but we're just going to shave off a little bit, and then we're going to go sleep. It is getting dark, and I do not want to be out here at night. Again, mobs spawn in massive quantities, because there's nowhere else except this giant fork for them to spawn. So where would you spawn if you were a mob? That's right, you know the answer. I am not on TikTok, no. I've actually never, I've never even downloaded it. I've never seen the app and I probably never will. I feel like I'm at that age where I think the last like social media that I'll use uh, is probably Instagram, honestly. I just don't, I don't know. I don't really like TikTok. I know it's not just videos of people dancing, but I also do not like the corporation that owns TikTok. I, I, I don't at all. I think a lot of people don't. We're not going to talk about that. We're not going to get into politics, you see. <laughs> well, actually, I'm the one who got into politics. Someone asked me about TikTok, and I'm like, oh, I don't like the company. I don't know. It's like, dude, chill out, man. Get off my stream. But I'm talking to myself, right? I'll just show myself out. I will get off my stream. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, okay, this is also bugging me real bad, because, like, yeah, but, nah, we're not going to do that. Do I have any cobble? We actually have an extra furnace. Heck, yeah. Okay. And then we're going to put a crafting table. Uh, I don't really know where to put one. We're going to make two crafting tables, and then with those two crafting tables, we can put them in a variety of places, like right here. Look at that. That works just fine, right? Um, okay. Man, there are 3,900 people here. I think that's the most people I've ever had on a stream. Uh, so first of all, thank you guys. It's only been an hour and 30 minutes. Doesn't feel like it's been that long, but somehow it has been. But thank you guys for tuning in to the stream. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, I'm having quite a bit of fun. This is a very unique map, um, to say the least. It is a very, a very unique map, and I'm very happy to be playing it for you guys. Again, if you want to check out the creator's YouTube video showing off this map and then subsequently check out their channel, please do. The link is in the description. Show them some love. They only have a thousand views on their, they only have a thousand views on their um, video showing off this world. Uh, that they created, and I really do feel like Sandbox Guy needs a little bit more love because this map is absolutely incredible. I really hope he sees this stream at some point. He or she sees this stream at some point. 
Um, I guess Sandbox Guy would be... I don't know. I don't know. It's 2020, okay? Can't be, can't be too sure. We're going to grab some bones. We're going to grab some bones. And we're going to do a little bit of bone meal in here. Hopefully this will grow them. But you never know. You just never know. Oh, there's not one there. Melons are good food. They just... Even a stack of melons will only heal you a few times, though. That's why I typically don't even really bother with these. But, you know, this is a special map, guys. We're playing on a fork. Nothing is the same, right? Everything is different. We're playing on a fork. I mean, if that isn't different enough, I don't know what is. I don't know what is. Um, okay. We'll bone meal some things that look like they're almost grown. Sure. Okay. Being very careful as to not break things that are not grown yet because not a lot of room for error. We don't have any food. Um, so that's why I'm just trying to be uber careful here because I'd prefer it if we could get food going before too long so we can explore without having to die every two seconds. Okay. Let's go over here and let's make some bread. We can make four pieces of... No. Yeah, four pieces of bread. Look at me. I'm so good at math. Four whole pieces. Woohoo! Um, and I think that's all set up now. We're just going to let it grow. Can't do much more for it right now anyways. Yeah, so we're going to go explore a little bit. Let me find... Where's my rare chest? Did I not make a rare chest? I swear I made a rare chest, right? Oh, no. I took all the things to make the rare chest, and then I never made it. Uh-huh. I did. I remember doing that now. Um, okay, and then we definitely have a wood chest, which we can take a little bit of wood just to keep with us, and then the rest can just go into here. Uh, we probably won't need the shovel right now, but if we do, we do. Okay, let's go do a little bit of exploring. What time of day is it, though? Oh, it's midday. That's fine. We're going to go back to that cave that we said we were going to go back to a while ago. I'm going to try not to sprint as to save my food for when I get hit by something. Hopefully that works. Uh, and by the way, guys, I saw someone just said they bought some merch from me. Well, thank you. Um, I do have merchandise. Uh, the moderators can either spam the link or you can you, you can find the link on the description of this vid, this live stream too. Um, I do have merchandise. Not many people really buy it, I guess, because well, I don't really know why, but no one really likes my merch either. Either it's too expensive or the designs are bad. I don't know. But keep in mind, you can make everything you see there either black or white. Um, like the colors, you can do a blue orchid hoodie with like the black fabric or you can do the white fabric whatever you prefer I personally like the black color I think it looks really good uh, especially with the blue orchid design I don't really f know how I feel about the gold tin foil ones but you know what I haven't worn one I haven't bought one but I bet they're pretty cool oh okay see what I mean our health is already degrading quickly I'm trying to do this but it's so hard especially when these creepers man mainly the skeletons Every time you walk in there, the skeletons just laser you. That's one thing I really wish Minecraft could fix. The fact that skeletons are just so good. Like, they're so much better than you. Because, um, you know, they have infinite range. Not infinite range, but close to it. We're going to keep this bad boy because we're probably going to want to make a spawner out of it at some point. A diamond, I will gladly take that. We're just going to take everything in here. We're not going not gonna to be picky. But what was in here? Some bread? I will gladly take some bread. And a golden apple. Not a bad find. We're going to continue our exploration journey. We're going to just stay underground and see what we can find. I'm trying to go very... Tread very carefully here. Okay. Okay. Oh. I know it's dark. One second. Let me... Where did I pull my torches? I think all of my torches are gone. And Why is there one water right there? Hold on. Get out of here, water. We will at least grab a torch to hold in our hand. We probably don't need that one up there. So, Just so that you guys can see a little bit better. Uh, there's some lapis in here. Ooh, some coal. There we go. Now we can have some excess torches. I probably should have looked at those before I made them, but that's okay. There's almost 4,000 people. We're at 3,985 people. Um, there's 1,500 likes, which is awesome, but there's 3,000 of you here. So if everyone clicked the like button that is here right now, we'd probably get close to like 4,000 likes. We're at 4,000 people! Oh my god. That's so many people. 4,012 of you here. Well, welcome all to the stream. If you haven't left a like and you, you've never seen my channel before, 
Uh, I basically just make Minecraft content, so if you want to subscribe, you can. If you don't want to subscribe, that's also okay. Whatever you want to do, as long as it's making you happy, you should do it. Unless it's illegal, then don't do it. Uh, but yes, thank you guys for choosing to watch me. I know there's a lot of content creators out there. I say this a lot, but the fact that you guys are choosing to watch this random guy play a giant fork map, quite impressive, quite impressive. Okay, so we need not break into lava, as that will hurt. Will cause great pain. We're just going to seal off the lot. Maybe I shouldn't have done that because maybe we need obsidian. <sighs> okay. Well, we did it to the rest of the lava. We might as well just might as well just seal the deal on that one, right? Um, I know there's some coal behind me. We will go and grab that in uno momento. Okay. There we go. Is it just one? No. I was gonna say the map creator is not gonna do us like that. Just put one down. I know, I know I've said this a billion times. Go and check out the map creator. Again, link is in the description if you guys want to download this map for yourself or just check out the uh, map creator's channel. They've made a ton of cool maps. And uh, I really do f think that they deserve some more recognition. So go and uh, click on that link in the description and go and check out their channel. And uh, show them some love. You don't have to subscribe or anything. I'm not saying that. But, you know, you could pop in and say, hey, Neo sent me. And uh, the map's amazing. And I'm sure you would make his week. So please go and do that. And thank you. If you choose to do it. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to open a bag of Cheez-Its here. Just give me one second. Sorry, guys. I really had to eat those Cheez-Its. It was the best Cheez-Its I've eaten in seven years. Not really, but I was really hungry, so... Everything's better when you're hungry. Why are there so many... Hmm. I guess this is just a small, dark area underground. And I really hope it's not dark above ground. Like, I really hope it's not dark above ground, because that means we're going to die. Creepy shield. Okay. Blank creeper charge. What is that? How do you use a shield? So you just put it in your... Okay. I won't use it because I don't really like shields, but cool. <laughs> we can already make a netherite tool? Nah, we're not going to do it like that. Our first netherite tool ever. It would seriously be like the first netherite tool. Which is kind of funny. <sighs> okay. Um... Hmm... Hmm. It's not like a Minecraft villager. I'm going to go back up, but I'm afraid that it's going to be dark. So if it is dark, we're just going to stay underground. Uh, uh, it's definitely dark. Um, so we've been going. I'm going to make this stream two hours long, but keep in mind, guys. Yeah, there's just going to be an absolute ton of mobs. We're going to go straight back under. Not worth it to go back up right now. I'm going to make this stream two hours long, so you guys got 22 more minutes with me. Um, I'm going to try to stream this fairly regularly, so definitely make sure if you're new to the channel and you're not. If you don't have push notifications on, I really do encourage you. Ooh, okay. Cool. Um, if you don't have notifications on, I really would encourage you to do so just so you don't miss any of the future streams. Um, you can also uh, join my Discord server. Um, and if you do that, it makes it easy because I send out an at everyone message or Lauren will send it out or whatever. 
And uh, that way you guys don't miss any streams in the future. So if you want to join the Discord, feel free. Mods will spam the link to my official Discord. You can join it there. And uh, it's pretty cool, pretty cool. That way you don't miss any future streams. I know it's annoying. I keep telling you to do all these things. But you keep in mind, you don't have to do any of them. Uh, but I really would appreciate it if you guys chose to subscribe. Is there something in here? Of course there is. This map creator seriously is the best. Ooh, the Inferno Sword. Now that's a sword I can get behind. That looks pretty cool. Uh, gravel, we don't need that. I don't want a broken music disc. I don't really want the, a netherite ingot. <laughs> I'm, I'm always like, ooh, a diamond. I didn't see the netherite ingot. Oh, I'm an idiot, dude. That's seriously awesome, though. That's so cool. Well, my first netherite ingot was found on a giant fork. <laughs> That's just how it goes sometimes, right? My first netherite ingot was from a giant fork map. Interesting. Not to hate on the map, but this is, the, this is easily one of my favorite maps that I've ever played, but that's just crazy. I'm really sorry. Captain Redbeard, I saw. I guess I just now saw that you super chatted, and I really do apologize. What is going on? Can you guys calm down up there? Jeez. Hey, Captain Redbeard, I'm sorry. I, see, I saw you super chatted, and I guess I just forgot to say anything, but thank you for your super chat. You said, keep it up, kid. Hehe. <laughs> I'll do my absolute best, and I might be on the server later. We'll see. We'll see. Keep an eye out, potentially. Uh, but thank you, Captain Redbeard. You know I appreciate you. All of your help, all you do for the channel, I really can't thank you enough. Thank you. Uh, Minato Nam Namakazi, thank you for another super chat. You said, hey, Neo, I'm back. And boy, that was that was the line. It was a long line. Well, hey, I'm glad the line is no more and you're back from the line. I'm not really sure where you went, but welcome back to the stream. Um, and thank you for your super chat. Michelle, thank you for another super chat. You said take the broken disc. It plays and is amazing. All right. We're going to take it. I'm just trying to figure out what do I not need. Uh, we don't need eight arrows. I don't even have a bow. So Did I also not pick up this lapis? I didn't pick up any of the lapis. Okay, what can we throw on the ground that we don't need? Probably magma blocks. That We don't really need those. But yes, thank you, Michelle Knowles, for another super chat. You're too, you're too generous. You really are. Okay, we gotta, we gotta be very careful here. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. we can try this. All right, blow me up. Wait. Yeah, blow me up. Did that blow up all my torches? Ah, oh, man, I'm an idiot. Ugh. Why am I so dumb? I guess I, I should have figured that out. Well, that's okay. We have a lot more wood. We don't have any inventory space, and I really do want to be able to go back to my home at some point. But the issue I'm having here is that we're going to die if we try to do that. Uh, we really will just probably instantly die. Is there something under here? There has to be. Right? Okay, so there's some redstone, looks like. I'm trying to look. Do I see any diamonds or anything? Okay, so it's like halfway through the night, so we're going to try to get back up. We're going to try to get back up. The only problem is there's so, so, so... Ooh, Roy, welcome to another... Ooh, diamond! <laughs> Heck yeah. Look, Rook, Roy, you just gave me the best luck. Roy Smith, thank you so much for your huge super chat. Oh, hey, a new series. Stonks! <laughs> Yes, we're going to be doing this a uh, fork survival. It should be quite interesting. We got 10 diamonds. Things have been going very well. But yes, thank you so much for your huge super chat, Roy, and thank you for tuning into another stream. I don't think I've seen you in a in a cool minute, so it's I'm I'm always happy to see repeat stream viewers. So welcome back to another stream. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I hope you enjoy it. Uh, this will be uploaded after the fact. Unfortunately, I'm going to be ending the stream in like 17 minutes or so. I'm going to make each one of these about two hours or so. Um, but yeah, it should be pretty fun. I'm having a lot of fun with this map. It's a very unique map. Okay, now that's a challenge I can't back down from. Okay. <sighs> okay, we're going to make a temporary little little chest here. Uh, because I don't want to I don't want to throw away some of this stuff. But like, I don't need it immediately. So we're just going to put it in here. And those stack. Yeah, we're just going to put those things in here. I am going to make what I need to make, which is a trap door. 
You can just hear the immense amount of mobs up there. It's kind of terrifying. Roy Smith, thank you for another super chat. You said, I've been busy programming Discord bots, but yeah, I'm always glad to catch one of your streams. They're amazing. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, Lauren actually, uh, she did the dy is it Dino bot, I think. No, she set that up for our, um, for our Discord, and it seems to be working pretty well. Oh, my God. Whoa, 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 whoa. What did we just find here? Now, this is the best secret chest room. I love this map creator. Guys, please go and check them out. Link in the description. They make such an amazing map, and it's completely free, and you can play it. You got to be on Java, though, but look at that. Look at that. It looks like it's only going to work very well in zombies, but, I mean, a netherite sword. Uh-huh. I'll take that. Five netherite scraps. Oh, my God. We have two netherite ingots. Can you make them like this? No. I love the player model right here. <laughs> it looks so wacky. Oh, my God. Instant damage, two arrows. Jeez. Man, there's some hardcore stuff in here. Okay. I bet there's something behind it. No, there's not. That's okay. That's honestly one of the coolest little the coolest little mini dungeons ever. That's so creative. That's so cool. Okay, well, I'd love to go back above the ground, but it's still dark, and I, I will seriously instantly die. I mean, you can hear how many mobs there are above us. You just hear constantly. What are the chances that we find that, though? Like, for real, that's just, like, randomly placed in the ground. What are the chances? So rare. I'm just going to keep on a trucking through here. Just going to keep... Ooh, a little bit of iron. I will always take some iron. Um, we need iron armor quite badly. Um, oh, okay. Wait, is this the original? Yeah, this is where I started out, and it's about to become day. Okay, cool. I thought I was at the fall. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Isn't this my house? Hey! Welcome home. Cool. So this is my house. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Are both my doors shut? Yes. You see what I mean about the mobs? I mean, there's just so many and it's and it's, you know, it's not the map creator's fault. It's just because it's such a it's such a small map that they just, you know, they just tend to to get very close. Or very there's a very high chance for them to spawn. Um, like an extremely high chance. Okay, this is rare. 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 That too. That too. Probably the ender eyes. We're going to go back down, actually. I'm going to grab that stuff I kept. You guys remember that chest. We're going to go and grab that stuff because it was some good stuff. And I don't want to I don't wanna just, like, ignore it. Okay. And then we can grab these. Please tell me. Yes. Let's see if we can get this pickaxe broken. I think one more thing. Two? Three? Four? Five? Okay. Okay, good. Because my voice couldn't have gone any higher there. I can only go so high with my voice, so it would have been like... Six? <laughs> Something like that. Okay, we're going to put all the wood up. All the wood stuff, I guess. Um, all the block stuff. This is a good bit of rare stuff, so we'll put this all down here again. I'm trying to keep, you know, stuff somewhat sectioned off. You know, of course, this isn't like a super long-term world, so we're not going to spend a lot of our time organizing, but we'll st still do our best to organize it somewhat. Okay, these spiders are driving me up the wall. Okay, so I'm liking this. You know, again, I've never had a netherite sword. Oh my god, thank god creepers don't blow up stuff. They will, however, kill their, their brethren quite quite easily. This is a nice sword, dude. Look at those enchants. Unbreaking one and smite. So it has 2,000 durability, and that has 1,500. So it has a little bit more durability. I don't know. Netherite's pretty sweet. It's pretty sweet. We're going to smelt this up. We're going to also smelt this. We're, we're, we're going to craft that into something because I really need some armor. Because I keep dying. So we're going to make a chest plate. Going to make some legs. And we're going to make a helmet when we can. Uh, which I think that's enough, right? There we go. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, we already had a chest plate. But it's almost broken. All right. So we're suited up now, guys. We're suited up. We're going to go check out our farm. Right after we kill this guy. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Okay. 
Yay, we actually have some melons already. I guess because we, we uh, use bone meal on them, so I guess it only makes sense. So next stream's going to be awesome because we'll actually have a stable source of food. Roy Smith, thank you so much for another super chat. Are we getting one of your famous chicken statues on this series too? Uh, actually, on this on this live stream series, I opted not to do any signs for people who super chat and stuff like that, just because it takes so much of the stream's time, and uh, like I'd rather have more content out. Not to say that I don't appreciate everything, but a chicken statue, hmm, maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll do it next stream or something. I don't know. We'll figure something out. But yeah, that was extremely funny when I made that. I still can't believe what I had created. I seriously created a monster. Like, I really did. I created a monster. Chicken, um, this, these are not for you. These are the premium Who Man plant seeds. You know, you, you can get one seed. How about that? And you can get another seed to go. He's still just following me. Okay, stop following me. You're making me nervous. I wonder, is there anything in any of these trees? I mean, I don't see anything, so I doubt it, but... I feel like there would be. We're going to climb. We're going to. What is going on? We're going to climb up and find out. So, yeah, this map is a giant fork. There's 4,179 people. That is the most people I've ever had on a stream. Thank you guys so much. That's seriously so many people. Why you're watching me again play on a giant fork, I have no idea. But just know that I really do appreciate all the support, guys. Seriously. Thank you guys so much. So you can't really tell, but the fork sporks are down there. This is the butt of the fork. But as you can see, there's many fun things we're gonna explore in the next few episodes. So again, if you don't have if you don't have me on your subscription list, I really do recommend subscribing because we're gonna be exploring quite a few fun things in the next few streams. So if you're not subscribed, you're probably gonna miss it. Uh, but you know, you can always watch it after the fact. We have the flat moon. That chicken still haunts me. It was my fault. I remember. <laughs> yes, it was. But that was a very interesting time. Put it that way. That chicken just... Well, honestly, it made me kind of uncomfortable. It also made me laugh harder than I'd laughed in I don't know how long. All because of a chicken statue. Quite interesting how the human brain works, right? Quite interesting indeed. I don't really know why. Let's round it off to 50 euros, I think. No, pounds. Wait. Euros are... I don't know. Let's round it off to 50. I love seeing you grow this much. I'm going to go try to catch more of these. Well, heck yeah. Uh, again, these are all uploaded after the fact. So, you know, if you're busy or whenever they come out, you can always watch them. I know live streams aren't as fun to watch after the fact. But, you know, if you're ever especially missing watching me live or something, you can always go back and watch some you missed. This series is going to be pretty fun. I plan on uploading all these after the fact. Again, if you guys aren't subscribed, please do subscribe so you don't miss the future... Um, so don't just subscribe though. if you just subscribe not gonna it's not gonna do anything you gotta subscribe and turn on the notification bell it's not that I really want you to it's not that it's just that it, you legitimately will not know uh, when I start streaming if you don't click the notification bell too you can thank YouTube for that not me it's not my fault okay it's not my fault okay but Roy Smith seriously thank you so much for the huge donations I always do really appreciate it I really really do thank you so much Ooh. You know what, Roy Smith, this this chest is donated that this is this is going out to you. We're gonna turn on the engines. We're gonna turn off the engines, I guess. We're gonna check the chest. Broken glass, sharpness two. Ooh. Wait, what what is that? Can someone tell me what what is this actual item? Oh, I can hit stuff with it. How much damage is it gonna do? That's what I wanna know. Something else back here? Death? There's death back there. That's a fact. We could die easily. What is that? What, like, what item is that supposed to be? Um, I really don't. I legitimately don't. A prismarine shard. Okay. I was going to say, like, what the heck is that? Okay, let's go ahead and find some mobs. We got about seven minutes or so left on the stream, so I'm going to try and find some stuff. See if we can't kill something. Can you please hoe that one bit of dirt? It's not hoed. I love the chest. Okay. Yes, I do know exactly what you're talking about, and honestly, I don't know why I keep ignoring it. People like you push me to do what I truly should do. But thank you, Roy Smith, for all the donations. You've, you've seriously donated so much in such a short amount of time. But know that I, re I really do appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, we will go till this. I don't know why. I keep seeing it, and I'm just like, nah. I think it's because of this. I think it's because of the vine. There's nothing planted here, but look. 
Ha ha. I hate vines. We're going to probably remove all these trees, at least above the farm. Just so they don't interfere anymore. And we'll go and grab this. Okay. Let's go. I want to see how much damage it does. That's what I'm curious about because... I mean, it, it's obviously going to have unlimited durability because it's a prismarine shard. It doesn't have durability. Uh, but it has sharpness too. So this would be kind of a cool weapon to use. Just because... Well, infinite durability, right? Even better than netherite. Just joined, I'm confused. We're playing on a giant fork. You can go back and watch the rest of the stream, but basically that's the gist of it. We're playing on a giant fork. I'll show you the uh, spokes of the fork. Or not the spokes, the... The prongs of the fork are right here. Okay, sheep, you're dead. You just made me mad. Two hit kill on a sheep. Two hit kill on a sheep. That's some damage. But yes, these are the prongs of the fork. Just to prove to you. This is where I wanted to go explore. You see that right there? That thingy. We're going to go check that out. We're also going to do We're gonna do a sick, nasty 360 jump into the water. Look at this. Not <laughs> Oh, perfect, right? Okay, we'll go explore this, and then we are going to call it a stream. Let's see. Let's finish this stream off big. Hopefully we get a... I don't think we can top finding a netherite sword, but maybe we can find something. Ooh! Oh, that's super fast! It doesn't... I mean, it's just, you know, gold, but that's, like, super fast. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Mining the gold with the gold. It's only necessary. Either way, guys, thank you so much for all of the viewership on this stream. Oh, I love how it breaks that, but you don't even get anything. Um, this has seriously been the, st the biggest stream I've ever done. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys so much. 4,000 of you here. That's absolutely incredible. Keep in mind this video will, or this stream will be uploaded after the fact. So you can always go on my channel and watch this whenever you want to. Thank you to all of my mod squad for doing all the, the heavy lifting here and, and, you know, moderating the chat. It's a very necessary thing. And I thank you guys for all of your hard work. Uh, for those of you who watched the entire thing, thank you so much for the support. For those of you who donated, thank you for the support as well. Um, if you guys don't want to miss the next stream again, make sure you're subscribed with post notifications on. Um, we will have, why did YouTube recommend this? I don't know. YouTube has its ways, right? Uh, but thank you guys all so, so much. See you in the next one, Lee. Thank you so much, Roy. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And I hope everyone else has a wonderful rest of their day. We will end the stream with sleeping if we can sleep. <laughs> you hear Loki and go, Mrow! makes the weirdest noises for a cat. Uh, something 0102, thank you for another super chat. You said it's been a wonderful stream. Forks are beautiful. Yes, they are. Again, I hope you guys did enjoy this stream. There will be more of it very soon. So, again, make sure post notifications are on. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye!